This was a debate that focused on Quebec voters, so a variety of social issues that could swing them one way or the other. And the issue that was anticipated and raised was that of the NICAB. NDP's Tom Mulcair saw his support drop in the province after the last French debate, and many believe it was because of his stance on the NICAB. Mulcair repeated his stance this time around, that women have to show their face to an official, but can choose to swear the oath with their veil. But he did try to distance himself at one point by saying there is no one who is pro NICAB. Conservative leader Stephen Harper told Mulcair he's offside with Canadians and said Mulcair's MPs don't even agree with him on this issue. And there were some good moments because of mistakes. In an exchange with bloc leader Gilles Duceppe, Justin Trudeau called him mon amour. Translation, my love, instead of mon ami, my friend. There were some laughs, of course. Trudeau explained this club, saying Duceppe was bringing up so much past and history, the sponsorship scandal and Jean Chrétien. Trudeau said he felt like Duceppe was bringing up all this history. It was like fighting with his wife. Another mistake that happened was with Duceppe again. He kept calling former governor of the Bank of Canada, Art Carney, who is actually an American actor, instead of Mark Carney, until Trudeau gently corrected him. But overall, Harper was the target of this debate, but he had sharp attacks back on his opponents. Mulcair was stronger in this French debate than the previous one, but he often stood to the sidelines. And Trudeau had some strong moments, in particular in the debate with Stephen Harper on marijuana. And when it comes to Gilles Duceppe, he often stood on the sidelines, calling out other leaders on their spin. So with the fifth and final debate now done, it's a sprint to E-Day. Hannah Thibodeau, CBC News, Montreal.